Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your host Khan Baba. Today is 18 of Feb, Sunday morning. God will give you more happiness and long life. I try to my level best to give you latest update about the Nard. So please like and share my video with your friend and family, which will help me for supporting. And now let's start the today information. We are still waiting for the CBI's measures to take hold to control the parallel market rate and then so. They can go ahead and raise the program rate one more time, as I am told by my CBI contact is still going to happen. Some good news is that new measures taken by the CBI this period in regards to the issue of controlling the parallel rate. The directorate said in a statement received by Baghdad today, and I quote from the article, for the purpose of simplifying procedures and working on real steps related to automation, it was decided to transfer all financial transactions electronically through the POS point of sale system in traffic departments in Baghdad and all governorates instead of cash dealing. How does this affect the progress of the project to delete the zeros? A statement just put out in Iraq by the CBI says so much and it is a borderline. Wow! Article for us today as Dinar Investors. Because if you remember what the economic expert Nasser al Kanani suggested, this action of the CBI coincides as it says to use electronic financial transactions eliminating paper in the marketplace is the first step in his list of suggestions, which by the way is also in the 2011 Dr. Shabibi plan. In other words electronic banking and POS has been on the radar and will continue to be pivotal in the monetary reform process. It is a very good step, a sign in the right direction and may help take the demand off the dollars thus. Reducing the rate in the black market for the dollar. Folks we must just sit tight and let them work. Through these issues of the parallel rate, the CBI will get it under control. Of course, it doesn't help. Either that any sanctions from the US Treasury on Iraqi private banks will affect the exchange rate of the dollar against the dinar. It is like a double-edged sword. The CBI must find ways to combat the corruption but at the same time in doing so, for now, it is counterproductive in reducing the parallel market rate. But when you deal with the US dollar, as was the focus of the Iraq economy, then when the US tells you to get off the dollar. Yet they still want Iraq to sell oil in petrodollars thus is not also helping Iraq to obtain the much needed other foreign currencies to use to buy imports. Thus, the dollar always still manages to come out on top as king dollar. The more I analyze the situation and those other Iraqi economists analyze this precarious situation of Iraq. We can clearly see that the problem always seems to point right back to the US government on its insistence that Iraq stay on the petrodollar for oil sales. Goodbye.